Hey guys and welcome back to Goatman Arts. Today we're going to be doing a quick tip video on how to avoid this particular error message on After Effects. Run titles. So today I'm going to show you a few ways on how you can resolve and avoid this error. But first, make sure your computer matches the system requirements for After Effects. And remember, if you're using any third-party plugins like Particular or Element 3D, or even just using a lot of layers or creating something with 3D cameras, you're going to need more than the recommended requirements. Before we start, let's make sure we do actually have two frames selected for playback. Remember, you can set your work area by going to the start and the finish of the timeline and pressing B and N on your keyboard. If everything's set up correctly and you're still having this problem, here's something that might help. Purging is the quickest way you can fix this issue. While you're in After Effects, go to your edit menu and go down the list until you find Purge. Then go across to Memory and Disk Cache. What this will do is empty all your RAM cache. And for those of you who don't know what cache is, caches are just where After Effects stores its results of a render. If you're still having the problem, let's go ahead and try step two. Before doing this step, you should know the small green bar above your timeline represents RAM cache. By doing the previous step, this should have cleared it. So at this point, you'll most probably see a blue bar. This represents disk cache. It's After Effects' way of being able to write things to RAM faster. In this step, we're gonna go ahead and clear that as well. And to do that, go over to your preferences. Windows users will find preferences under their edit menu, whereas Mac users will find it under After Effects. Once you've found that, select Media and Disk Cache. This should bring up a window, and once you're in there, go ahead and go down to Empty Disk Cache. Now you should see that all renders have been cleared. While we're in the preference window, it won't hurt to go ahead and clean Database and Cache. If you're still seeing the message at this point, then there's a few more things we can do. First, make sure all of the programs and applications are closed. Any music or videos playing on the same system will slow the RAM usage for After Effects considerably. Next, try changing the preview quality of your footage from full to half, or even maybe quarter. This isn't ideal, but may help After Effects render the footage in. Finally, if you're still unable to view your footage, I recommend rendering off what you can and re-importing it. By selecting lossless in your video rendering queue and going to the video output section, you can change a channel from RBG to RBG and Alpha. This will give you a transparent background on your media, meaning you can re-import it to After Effects and place it back onto your footage and simply hide the original. Well guys, I hope this has helped. If you're still having trouble after all of these steps, I recommend saving what you've done and restarting After Effects. If the problem still persists after that, then do check the system requirements with the link in the description. If anyone else has any other tips on how to avoid this, then do be sure to leave the comments down below. Until next time though, you've been watching Goatman Arts. Thank you and goodbye.